Hey gang, I am not gonna growl at today. Okay. Don't do a lot of these days. Growlers are not as common, but I got this from River Roost Brewing in White River Junction. Vermont is becoming one of my favorite little IPA brewers in Vermont. So this beer is called Doubtful Guest. I got it filled yesterday. I think they released cans of this maybe a month ago, maybe less, I don't know. Um, so they had three different cans there. But I just love their beer, and you can bring any growler any place, you know, in Vermont and get it filled at reasonable prices. So I'm doing this one. I had this, a growler this last year, or last summer, um, and I really liked it. But now they've been canning this one, too, and kind of regularly, so I thought maybe it was worth doing a review. If you're ever going on your way to, like, Stowe or Burlington from the Boston area, it's like, this is right off, right off the highway. Very good place to stop. So this one has mosaic and Denali hops. And looks like a lot of their beers do. Very pale, very hazy. Um, could be a little milky or white, but very pale orange. Head looks pretty darn good. I wish Denali hops were used more often, but because it smells just like really good pineapples and weed. And the mosaic's throwing in some very good peachiness. And it seems like the, their yeast does throw some esters, but it's it really just helps support the, the hops. Mm, and I love like there's this nice slight dankness. It just smells like really fresh hops. And there's a creaminess, like a cotton candy thing going on. It does smell pretty sweet. That's thing, one thing about a lot of their IPs is that they're rather sweet. Mm. Mm. It's sweet, but it's got some nice bitter dank resinous qualities that help to kind of balance things out. Mm. That's really nice. The mouthfeel isn't ultra soft. It is it's sort of like medium-ish, but it has some weight to it. Mm. <laughs> this is really nice. It is a bit sweet. You gotta be kind of in the mood for a, a sweeter IPA. Um, but it does the whole super fruity, juicy thing, extremely well, with some, you know, estery candy edges in there, but it's not so much that it tastes like birthday cake or something like that. That's what I find, especially with beers these days that you use like cashmere and sabro, um, it just is like cake, you know, <laughs> a cake beer, pound cake. Um, this one is got enough fruit going on. I like a lot of fruit in there and Sometimes a little bit of dankness and some malts. This one, I don't really get a lot of malt character. But I just love the super free hop and the touch of raw hop in there. It just seems ultra fresh too. No off flavors. Yeah, four and a half plus for Doubtful Guest. Highly recommended. Go to River Roost. Bye.